Wonderful people, my name is Doug Fricano, and I'm the son of Gus Fricano, the founder of Fricano's Pizza, which he started in Grand Haven back in 1949. My father brought pizza pie to Michigan 65 years ago, and we've made a lot of pizzas since then, trust me. Recently, we were awarded by Pure Michigan as the best pizza in the state. That was back in August of 2011. What I'm going to do right now, because we've had so many people ask over all these years, what is it about your pizza that makes it so amazingly delicious? What is it about your pizza that makes us crave it time and time again? Why do we love it so much? Well, let me tell you, I'm going to reveal that secret to you right this very minute. In the palm of my hand, I have what I believe is the secret to the Fricano's pizza pie. Okay, zoom in, Jake. That's what we got. That, ladies and gentlemen, is a pizza crust in its infancy stages. This is the same crust that my grandma made. She procured it in her kitchen on Columbus Street in Grand Haven back in 1949 when my father asked her, Mom, make me a pizza. My grandma refused because she didn't think it's what the Americans wanted. But my dad persisted and my grandma made the crust. She procured the pizza, and this is the same exact crust that she made back in 1949. This crust is the most unique, incredible crust of any pizza you've ever eaten. It is the perfect crust. It is what, in my opinion, makes Fricano so special. So follow me through the process that we perform to get the pizza that you so love and desire. Watch what we do, and watch how we make this happen. All right, here we go. Here's the crust. Blob of dough, not just any blob of dough, grandma's dough. We flatten it out to make it look round, and then we run it through the roller. The roller loves this crust, and our crust loves this roller. It's quite a match. So we put it through the first time, and we come up with what we call a football. We hit it again with a little flour, and we send it through the roller for the second pass. And out it comes. Here, ladies and gentlemen, is what will be the foundation of the best pizza you've ever eaten. We take this crust, as perfect as it is, and it is perfect. It's the perfect crust in and of itself. There is no better crust on a pizza in the whole wide world. Believe me, once you eat one, you'll totally agree. We put on our pizza sauce, which is nothing special. It's just a good blend of the best pizza paste mile by. We throw the grated cheese on it. Notice how I measured that? We just know. We got the feel for it. Then we take what we call our second cheese. We call this first cheese because it goes on first. We call this second cheese because it goes on second. Pretty scientific, isn't it? So what I'm making right now is a blank. And from this blank, we get the orders and we make it a pizza pie. Here we've got a stack of blanks ready to go. This is the blank that I just made for you wonderful people. What would you like me to make? Our most popular pizza, ladies and gentlemen, is the everything but anchovy. I think that should be the selection of choice. That's what I'm going to make for you now. And when I'm done making it, we're going to throw it in the oven, and you're going to see just how amazing this pizza can be. Cut. We're back, ladies and gentlemen. This is what I made for you. This is the product before it goes into the oven. Once we throw it in the oven, that's where the magic takes place. The crust is the foundation, and it's just perfect for everything that lays on top of it. There's really no secret to our pizza, but if there is, it's the quality ingredients and the proper proportions baked in hot ovens with that excellent, most perfect crust that you've ever, ever eaten in your life. We'll get back to the crust just as soon as it's done baking. We'll show you what we're talking about. We're back, wonderful people. Step up closer to the, to the ovens here. First of all, I want to say I think I got the best looking baker this side of the Mediterranean. Yeah. Look at this guy. <laughs> show him the bottom of that pizza. This is what makes our pizza so perfect. Look at the firmness. Look at the texture. Look at the consistency. Look at how that pizza bakes up. Does that look wonderful or what? I think it's ready. Let's pull it out. Right here you go. That's a beauty. 
beauty right there. My father used to tell me the sign of good pizza is you want to hear the scissors snap, 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 snap. You hear it? That's what we got. Another thing he used to say is that the burn edges made him famous. We leave those on because people love them so dearly. But here's what we got. We've got a Furcano's pizza made with a perfect crust that's been made since 1949. That makes the perfect pizza. Look at the firmness. Look at how that crust holds up. So when you take a piece of pizza off this tin, it comes off, you slide it on your plate, and you look at it, and you go, oh my God, can this thing really taste as good as it looks? Well, let me tell you folks, one bite of Fricano's pizza, with this crust, and with all these toppings, with our quality, with our tradition, with our heritage, you're gonna know that you're eating the best pizza that you've ever had. Thank you for your time. Hope to see you here.